Well, Deidre, welcome back to South Florida. You're here, as I understand it, to promote your new book. The book is about life in my kitchen. Oh my goodness. Um, uh, my close pal, Lynn Bowman, and I, uh, about a year ago, had been looking for the perfect handbook for the kitchen, for busy moms, for busy women, working women, and, and just found that it wasn't there, so we wrote it. Um, and it is a book of a lot of our favorite uh, kitchen memories, kitchen moments, that will save you a lot of time, a lot of energy, and make you able to put a healthy, nutritious, delicious meal on the table in, yeah, 10 minutes. What was the motivation for writing the book? As I said, there wasn't one out there. Uh, I kept looking for, how do, how do I get around um, having stopped at the market, what do I have in here, and making the same six meals over and over. And women will tell you this. Um, we have like six things we do that are, that are great, and then we get so sick of them, and our family gets so sick of them, and it's hard to really sort of just bolt out of that mode. Um, and unless somebody provides us with an easy way to do it, we're not inclined to try it. So, um, uh, Lynn and I have been friends for 40 years, and we um, uh, would solve the world's problems sitting around the kitchen table. And usually it was, okay, I'll make something, and oh wait, what are you doing now? I want to write that down so I can do that when I get home. And um, uh, uh, then we thought, well, we need to write the book. It's just so great. I want to ask you about your ties to Southern Florida. You grew up here. I grew up here. Oh my gosh! It's um, I don't know if your audience can tell. We're, we're sitting with the, the windows open, and we're on the uh, I guess we're on the, the waterway. Um, it's just it, it, it is such a sense of being home. Uh, the moment I get off the plane and that weather hits me, um, clothes start coming off and my hair gets pulled back, and, and uh, it's just the best place to be. It's where I grew up, which was actually I grew up in Lantana. Um, uh, which is just south of West Palm Beach, um, and but being down here is uh, feels just the same as being home. I want to ask you about, as an actress, the dynamic of working on daytime television as opposed to a regular series or perhaps even a film. Working in daytime is such a different medium from anything we've ever known. It, it is. Um, um, I began my career in in uh, in television movies and television episodic when I was a nurse or a secretary <laughs> as we all started and um, uh, you come in you in one day you shoot I don't know maybe if you're lucky 10 11 pages of dialogue um, and it's it's a film setup so you've got to wait for the cameras to turn around everybody takes their turn in their set doing their part with somebody sitting off camera in daytime, uh, we work a three-camera show, and um, it happens right there. Best advice for aspiring actors and authors? Do it. Just do it. If you want to be an author, write. Write and write and write and write and write. If you want to be an actor, act and act and act. Um, and that isn't possible, I know, in, in, uh, in television. But get into a little theater group, get into uh, uh, a college class, get into... Um, uh, an improvisational class, get into any place you can get that puts you on stage doing dialogue. Deidre, again, best of luck to you on your book. Enjoy being home in South Florida. We're glad to have you back for a while. <laughs> Pick up the book. <laughs> enjoy and enjoy your free hour oh or two gosh. in Miami. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs>